Did they really fail though? It seems as though they're having a pretty good career, probably making a lot more money than they would have if they were acting, just acting. Today, I wanted to take a look at some YouTubers who originally moved to LA to pursue acting or who have acted in the past. As an actress and a YouTube content creator, I always find it interesting to find out about big YouTubers who used to want to pursue acting or pursued acting in the past. I think it's because we have that in common. Like I'm also an actress and then I made a YouTube channel. I'm obviously not nearly as big as any of these people, but I'm always so intrigued to see them acting. So today we're gonna look at some of their acting clips that are online, their acting reels, and um, just check it out. So I'm gonna ask myself, do I believe they're acting? Do I believe they are truly playing that character? Yes or no? The first YouTuber we're going to look at is Alexa Sunshine 83. Get your hands off me, you unruly wench. Don't you want to go home with me? Nope. Leave me to my business. Wait for me. I can help. Come on, please. Service to me to carry in my ammunition. Oh, don't worry. I'm good with that. Okay, so just that line. I can help. Come on, please. The... Uh, it's just really fast and I mean we can't see her face in this clip but just the fact that it's it's so fast and you can't really I, I, I don't believe anything <laughs> when you're trying to convince somebody that you can help maybe um, putting some kind of incentive hey ma'am it's a cute little gift shack you got here just way too adorable okay so in that part she's trying to convince that person to do something and she's she's being pretty like kind and honest in that part um in the first clip we can't see her face obviously but just the the way she she said it like i can help like you know like i didn't really believe that she wanted to go with him but in the second clip like i believe her she's just being nice but let's go to the next person so most people who are on buzzfeed are usually required to have on camera experience or you know be comfortable on camera and also be able to do editing and stuff behind the camera behind the scenes so the next one is a guy from the try guys and it's keith ha haggersberger how do you say his name habers habersberger and i happen to find his acting reel from 2012 so let's take a look at his acting reel i want to go home but you can't Let's all have s with each other. To the last of our per diem. Wait. Hello? Oh, God. Hi. I'm sorry. Just don't look at me. Madam, are you all right? I'm fine. Oh, oh Hamilton, please help. Franklin, please listen. Thomas, what are you still doing here? Do you want to be late? No. Just I play it pleasing and popular and wear a smile. No one likes a worry one. And if you ever just like loved and hated someone so much that they- Oh yes, dear child. His name is John Adams. You have really pretty eyes. Oh. I have the pie for the pie competition. Okay, so in this reel, it looks like the more acting heavy section is the very beginning where he's in some kind of short, maybe web series, but I totally believe Keith. I can definitely see him still being in movies in the future um, or web series, whatever, skits on YouTube, but I totally believe him. And again, his facial expressions are just very, very animated and I totally believe Keith. The next YouTuber is Colleen Ballinger, and if you know who she is, aka Miranda Sings, you probably know that she's an actress, but I wanted to put her in here because I feel like sometimes people might forget that she's an actress because she is truly acting when she's Miranda Sings, and that is like gold. Being able to create your own character that you can play yourself forever. I have never seen her acting outside of Miranda Sings. And um, so I wanted to look at some of her acting clips today because I know she was on Broadway and I know she, of course, plays Miranda Sings. So I've seen her act as Miranda, but I thought it'd be fun to see if I would believe her in any other uh, any other 
person that she's playing. So this one I found, it just says, Escape the Night, Colleen Ballinger C. So all of a sudden we see this woman peeping Tom at our meeting. What the? What? Get what? Quick, get her! Oh, oh ain't going nowhere, mama. You need hey, to get your ass. <laughs> she takes off and I'm like, oh no, be. Just take one out, Annie. Bold, she's not contributing enough here, so she's got to go. I want Tila gone. I think we should put Matt up against Tila to ensure that Tila doesn't win. Something's in there. I know if we can open it, something good might happen. Hey, guys, come here. I need to talk to you, please. We're running out of time, and this box is the only thing we know so far that might help us out. We need to figure out how to open this thing, and the only- Wait, this is hilarious because I, have I seen Escape the Night? I don't think I have. I know that I've seen clips, like commercials, advertisements, but this is funny because Escape the Night is like all YouTubers. <laughs> you're a so, liar. I don't, believe it. I don't believe anything that you say. Why? I know because you're the reason we all are here in the first place. You know things that you're not telling us. You're being sketchy. Your friends are dying. You don't seem to care. I think you need to go home because I think you're a liar. I do not trust you. How long can you be friends with someone who's brought you to a place that's put all of us in danger and we're dying, so. I can see a little bit of like wheels turning of almost like, what's my line? I don't know how Escape the Night is uh, scripted. I don't know if it's fully scripted, if they get the scripts in advance, but a couple of lines, like I can tell a little bit that she's thinking of what next to say. So that definitely makes me feel like I don't quite believe her there, but in general, I believe her. The next one is another BuzzFeed girl or ex-BuzzFeed girl, Sophia Nygaard. So this is her acting reel and I did see it a while ago, but I don't remember if I believed her acting or not. <laughs> um, excuse me? Yes. Hey there, it's me. You superior creature, you godlike being. And so we made love to each other to dream it was you, the both of us. Have you ever tried an iced non-fat chai vodka? No. You're missing out. Do I go hard? Yes. Do I drink dangerously? No. Because I'm f***ing responsible! Look what I found. The shirtless yurt. Brick, how long does it have to go on? This punishment? Haven't I served my term? Can I apply for a pardon? Is that clip supposed to be um, a streetcar named Desire? Oh, duh, it's Cat on Hudson Roof. I'm sorry, guys, I haven't read either of those plays or seen them in a very long time, but I should have known when she said brick. Okay, I have to say, in the first couple of clips, I definitely believe her. In this black and white clip, I don't believe her. Just something about it it's just doesn't suck me in, it's just lines. I almost just hear the words and I don't like, I'm not really listening to it that much. I just hear like a sound, you know what I mean? What would Brangelina do? Two words. Secret relationship. In your student-led self-help seminar? Hello and welcome to the first day of class, the science of the social ladder. <sighs> I'm really sorry, Annie. I did pee in it, but I took all the clothes out first. Okay, I think this reel is edited in a really fun way where you actually want to keep watching it because in a lot of reels, people see a couple of seconds and they're like, okay, we get the point. We get, you know, if we like your acting. Um, I thought it was fun. Some of them I believed her, some of them I didn't. This is from a very long time ago. It's from 2014. Um, so I love Sophia. I didn't believe her in some of them, and I did believe her in some of them. The last person that we're gonna look at today is Ryland Adams. I just Googled Ryland Adams acting reel, and it took me to a website, rylandadams.com forward slash acting dash one. And it looks like something here is unavailable, and that was probably his acting reel, so that makes me a little sad. But the other clips down here, uh, our YouTube channel and that YouTube channel is called uh, Lark Lark Who's There. So let's watch some of his acting here on this YouTube channel. Guys, I swear to God I got recognized at Air One today. Shut the up. Yeah, two people asked for pics and people were staring oh at me. Oh my God, yay. Oh honey, you, you have, have a, a dick, dick on, on your face. face. What? Okay, that what? I didn't believe it. I didn't believe it. 
Yeah, I didn't believe that what, and the even the text before, I, I didn't believe it. None of these YouTubers, are they like, I completely just didn't believe a second of it. And I'm like, no, they, I, I didn't feel, you know, that they were saying the truth or being truthful or anything. Um, but all of these YouTubers, I am sure they are completely happy to now be YouTubers because they have creative freedom. They don't have a boss. They can create whatever content they want. They don't have a set schedule. They make their own schedules. And if they really, really wanted to become actors today, they could definitely afford a great acting coach and become actors and maybe win an award or two. Thank you so much for watching. And at the end of every video, I feature another YouTube channel. And today I wanted to feature Moiza. She uh, makes vlogs on her channel and also talks about her small business, a lot of behind the scenes of small business. And if you would like to be featured on my next video, make sure you're subscribed, like this video and leave me a comment.